find the union of each of the following pairs of sets in this question we have some pairs of sets and we need to find their union we know that the union of two sets a and b is the set of all those elements the set of all those elements which are either in A which are either in A or in B or we can also write this as A union B is nothing but set of X such that X belongs to A or X belongs to B this definition simply means we need to club the elements of both the sets to get their union so in our first section we have X union Y is a set containing elements 1 2 3 and 5 similarly for section 2 we have a union B is a set containing elements a B C E I O and U and in the third section we are given a is equal to set of X such that X is a natural number and multiple of 3 now if you wish to write it in roster form it will look like 3 6 9 12 and so on and B is equal to set of X such that X is a natural number less than 6 again if we write it in roster form it will look like 1 2 3 4 and 5 now if we wish to find their union we will write A union B is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 9, 12 and so on or we can write it in set builder form as A union B is equal to set of X such that X is equal to 1, 2, 4, 5 or a multiple of 3 or a multiple of 3 in the fourth section we have a is equal to set of x such that x is a natural number and x is greater than 1 and less than or equal to 6 so the elements of this set are 2 3 4 5 and 6 b is equal to set of x such that x is a natural number and x lies between 6 and 10 so the elements of this set are 7 8 and 9 when you club the elements of both these sets you will get a union b is equal to 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 and this can also be written in set builder form as set of x such that x lies between 1 to 10 and x belongs to natural number in the last section we have set a consisting of elements 1 2 and 3 and B is an empty set so their union is nothing but set a itself so our answer is a union B is equal to set containing elements 1 2 and 3 this is nothing but set a itself because we know that the union of an empty set and a non empty set is the non-empty set itself. So this completes our solution.